sometimes destiny is like a train journey. Sometimes your destiny comes on a train. And sometimes destiny is like a train coming towards you. My name is John. I am an assassin. And if I'm your destiny, you won't even hear me coming. Did I miss? Do you get off on this? Would you be so bad if I was untied? Do you still think you stand a chance? Because a pussy like you? Yeah! See my life? Come to the warehouse. Let's just go on again. Okay. Good. 
Mine's elsewhere. Talk to me. That guy's still hustling me. Has he been to the restaurant? No. But I think he's still watching me. And I keep getting phone calls at the house. Trina's getting worried. Maybe I should get some protection. A gun or something. No. I've got some people checking into it. Don't play their game. Well, that was clever, wasn't it? I had to get your attention somehow. You know I've got to train for my next fight. So much that you forget who I am. So I make you feel like that. I just want to be with you and concentrate on us. Not just watching you train. Babe, you know how I feel about you. I want you in every part of my life. I know I've been neglecting this lately. So ever since I was a kid, I dreamt about being a martial artist. Oh, I've invited Jan and Nation round for a barbecue next week, so no training sessions. Okay, babe. Competition. Kane did. <laughs> you could have just got money invested in you. I've got some time off next week. How about a training session? Cool. If you can keep up with me. Can I borrow some shoes? As usual. Hmm. So, what outfit are you wearing next week? Um, my new cream suit. So, what kind of shoes are you after? Mm. How about your court shoes? Or the stocky ones? How's things at the restaurant? Fine. That's late business. Oh, you know what you do. You feel all right. The only time when you ask about my life is when you're covering up for something. Well, how little you know me. For a few weeks. Now, Jem's been acting really strange. He nearly bit my head off when I asked if everything was all right. The phone rang and he just froze. He scared me. I look after myself. And the only reason I'm telling you this is because you own half the business. Gemma, I'm on your side. What do you think it might be? I'm not sure. Maybe John could have a word with him. You look like something out of a horror movie. Uh-uh. It was a heavy. You want protection, man? 
Is that how you got that? He did this to you? Yeah. Trini's asking questions. What am I gonna do? Describe him to me. What's up? Can't you handle your missions? You're pushing your luck! Don't test me! Oh, what? You couldn't handle a kid? And you think you can stand up to me? One of these days, I'm gonna put a bullet in your head. If I don't put a bullet in you first... I see! You want me to punch a hole in your head? Don't make me laugh! From this range, I can blow you through the wall! Both of you! Back up, now! Where's John? He's late. Relax, boys. I'm only ten minutes late. Some help. What's wrong? Someone visited my restaurant. There's two at the Mendo. They're mine.
two men made me choose my destiny. My dad. Then my brother. Now I live the life of a killer. I can't remember all the people I've killed. Now I live the life of a killer. It was two other men that changed my destiny. The first I saw only once, and I never knew his name.
Okul nasıl gidiyor? İyi gidiyor baba. Bilirsin. Düşmanlarım çoktu hocam. Benim gibi olmanı istemem. Bir gün senin gibi adam olabilirsem. Baba ne mutlu bana. Senin düşmanlarım benim düşmanlarımdır. Beni iyi dinle oğlum. Ben küçükken babam hep bana bu hikayeyi anlatırdı. İnsanın kafasında iki dağ kurdu yatarmış. Bunlar hep birbiriyle dövüşürmüş. Biri ise sevgi, diğeri nefretmiş. Bir gün sordum babama, hangisi daha güçlüdür? O da bana hangisini beslersen dedi. Benim ismimi sevgiyle yaşatmalısın. Nefretle değil. two other men that changed my destiny. The second I've known since we were kids, but you don't ever want to learn his name. parted ways when I took sole control of our cartel. But he returned. To teach me one last lesson in destiny. since we were kids, but you don't ever want to learn his name. Now I live the life of a killer.
Where will you go? It's better you don't know. Will you come back? No. How long do we have to wait? No one asked you to come along. I wanted to see the big man in action. That's what they say about you, you know. That you're a big man. <laughs> so when do we get to kill somebody? You get your chance. You are so sexy when you act hard. I just love a hard man. Not yet. When? We make a move only when I say. Only when I say. This is a fucking waste of time. Get in the car. What, we're gonna follow them? You catch on quick. Why are you doing this? Because I owe him. Why did you leave? Why did you come for me? I owed you. You killed the fuck that killed my dad. We took your dad's tattoo as our symbol. We named our cartel White Flower because of the one found beside his body. We did this to honour him. I left because what we were doing wasn't honouring him anymore. I don't know what I'm becoming. Or what I've become. Did my dad ever tell you the story of the mountain wolf? We feed the wolves to survive, John. You have a choice. You always have. Be the man your father was, or the man your father wanted you to be. They're gonna get you soon. <laughs> Who's afraid of the big bad wolf? This is for 
far as you go. <laughs> no way, baby. Me thinks I deserve some action after all this waiting. You're still new. I don't trust you. If you get in my way, I'll kill you. Is that any way to talk to a lady? How is Walsh? I hear he's a bit tied up. John will be here soon. And when you're both dead, we'll take over. You know, people said I was crazy for handing the organisation to you. You were. You still are. Who told you where I was? We got word that uh, another organisation had taken you. And you never thought it could be one of our own? You did. Know your enemy but pretend you don't. See your enemy, but pretend you're blind. Know their hand without showing them yours. Looks like your plan might have worked, Kane. I should give you more credit. was a trap, John. You should have stayed out of it. I would have handled it. Things didn't work out that way. You almost jeopardised everything we built up. You've gone soft. You've gone old. An old wolf.
You! Stay here! Get him! Get him! You're underestimating him. He's tougher than you think. We need more men. We're not finished yet.
closer. Any tricks, and I'll shoot Wolf. You should have stayed outside, John. What do you mean? You got one shot left. The moment you pull that trigger, you're dead. Go ahead. You want me to shoot you, don't you? You'd rather get it than him! Make you move. We all thought war was crazy giving the organization to you. It was. But it still is. You got so wrong. Who? What did you do that for? Finishing business. Talk, talk, talk. All you men ever do is talk. You know your biggest weakness. You're the best. When you're not the best and you're fighting to be, you have something to fight for. When you are the best, you don't fight anyone but yourself. Stay. Like the old days. Remember what I used to tell you? That killers are funny people. We see clearly through one eye then two. The eye of a gun has a way of putting things into focus. Next time you look into a gun, notice what you see and let that guide you. This is where I came in all those years ago. There's so much I need to tell you. It's all right, John. It's all being said. But I wanted to tell him that I knew one thing. Killing is like getting your first fuck from a woman or becoming a father. It's even stronger than your destiny. Once you've done it, you can't go back. You know what I liked about you when I first saw you? I saw you. The real you inside. When no one else could hear you, I heard you.
my name's Mrs. Stevenson. I manage this agency. What can I do to help? Adoption means legally giving up responsibility for your child. A birth parent does not have the right to see the child after he or she has been adopted. If you are worried about your child not growing up with a sense of where he came from, we can ask the adoptive parents to keep a life book which tells him everything about you. And we can tell you as much about the adoptive family as you wish. Are you a mother? Then why give your baby up at all? Because sometimes loving someone so much means giving them away. Because that is a selfless option. You're a bit quiet. Is that feel okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I just enjoy our time together. I wonder when we can move on. Do you ever think what your life could have been like? You know, if you hadn't met me. No. You need to realise our destiny was written. We were meant to be. I was hoping you'd say that. Because my life would be empty without you. Have you ever thought about nothing? What? Nothing. What? Well, I've been thinking about us having a family. I've had the same feelings. That with the way that our lives are, or my life is, maybe one day. Look, there's nothing I want more than to have children with you. Please just give me time to sort out my life to sort out our future. We're gonna change our lives. If you really mean that this time, you don't know how much that means to me. I love you. I have a few things to sort out first. How about you pack? After this. One, babe. <laughs> Next step, roll champion. <laughs> just don't forget me. You're looking happier. I just love you. Pass back, babe. this? What's going on, Jim? Don't worry. It's for protection. P protection? From what? Is this why you've been acting strange? 
Just let me handle this, okay? Handle what? What's going on? Don't hold anything back. Please, tell me. Some guy's been trying to extort money from the restaurant. He attacked me. Look, I'm scared too. But please, you have to have faith in me. And I do have faith in you. White flower, nice front. Thinks I can spice things up around it. Well, the only way you're going to be able to do that is by sticking to me extremely closely. The only way I'm going to be able to do that is by learning from the best. is to wipe out every other organisation, leaving us with all the territory. The other organisations will merge to beat us. We can make it work. Don't be shy. Don't know why you're here. Don't flatter yourself. All I meant is we can work as a team. I know all about your little wifey, Aisha. If you ever put me in that situation again, I'll fucking kill you. I was just doing my job. They want to tag you, you prat. <laughs> fuck you and fuck the target. Don't get in my way again. Fuck you, about it. <laughs> What's going on? What happened? This prick. Strange. No one's heard of her until now. She's no amateur. Check her out more. I found out some information. What is it? The person who visited your restaurant was an assassin. Which organisation? That I'm trying to find out. Whoever it is, must have help.
Sometimes destiny is like a train journey. Sometimes your destiny comes on a train. I was a street punk until he found me. Did you go ice your way? It's okay, Jim. Reunions are so sweet. <coughs> Shut the fuck up. Where is she? Who's got her? What does it matter? You're all gonna die. John. Do you think you can handle it? Do you? Just shut from behind. Shouldn't be a problem. No. That's more your style. I'll beat him like a dog first. And then, when he's bleeding like a bitch, I'll tower over him. And bang. You really think it's gonna be that easy? No. Of course it isn't. Especially with you around. <laughs> yeah. You're gonna kill John, just like you killed Jem. Right, Ken? I've got plans for the both of them. Everything's there. What's the mission? Target is a man. He goes by the name of Tobias. He's well known to so be careful. He's got a lot of contacts. A lot of contacts.
shut up. Or I'll kill you. What do you want? Actually, I was looking for your man. But you do. <laughs> Where is he? Tell me. I don't know. What do you want with him? I want what I asked for. It's a shame it's come to this, but every story has to end. Please, just leave us alone. I keep begging. I enjoy being the one you beg to. You see, if a man had paid his dues, it wouldn't have come to this. God, just leave me alone, please. Crossing me is the biggest mistake he'll ever make. I'll see him again. He can't hide. And bang. You really think it's gonna be that easy? You're gonna kill John, just like you killed Jim. Right, Ken? Hide forever. Who's hiding? I'm here, aren't I? Yeah. But for how long? Cut the shit! You can't get away with this. I already have. <laughs> <laughs>
First his daddy dies, then his friend Wolf goes away, and he's left all alone to defend himself. Figured it out yet? Figured out who's been bullying your little brother Jem at the restaurant? Figured out who took Wolf? It's all one person, you know. One name, one man breathing down your neck, wanting your position, your life. Kay. And now he's got your lovely little wifey Aisha and your brother Jem. Poor, poor John. Everyone he cares about goes away. But I'm still here, John. <laughs> John, it's Ali. We've got Jem. You want to see my wife? Come to the warehouse. <laughs>
No one's dead yet. Poison ain't dead. <laughs> <laughs> What are you doing here? This is my mission. The moment you take any mission personal is the moment you fail. Ali did the right thing telling me about your failure. You fucked up. So, you could keep your mouth shut. Put the gun down, I'm warning you. You're warning me? Do you have any idea what you've done? Taking care of business. You were given a simple mission and you couldn't complete that. You're nothing, Kate. So you tell me. You've just ended your existence. Or you, the big hero. You make me sick. Don't fucking move unless you wish to see a hole in her head. I was in the shadows, waiting, watching. So remember this face, John. As the last face you'll ever see. So sorry. 